hello and welcome to my channel today in this video i'm going to show you how to insert multiple rows on sql developer so without wasting much of your time let's get into the video i have created a table called employees so let's go check it out select star from employees then let's run the query and you can see my employees table i have uh, two columns here employee number and employee name and uh, here let me drag it to so that you can see the remaining part of the column you can do the same here drag this one so that you can see the remaining parts of the table so let me insert one more row to this table what i will do here is insert into employees insert into employees then I have this or let me say insert insert into employees values so let me go for 10 for employee number and uh, since employee name is a string we have to use the quote so let me give it some gems gems then close so now let's run that let me clear this part let me take close this part and then run you can see one row inserted i can clear this part with this clear and i can clear this part with this clear here so let me select star from employees let's run and see what we have you can see we added 10 as the employee number and James James as the employee name. So now how do we add multiple rows to this table? There is a way some other SQL database management systems, you know, do that. But that way or that method doesn't work with Oracle. Let me show you that method. You can say, okay insert into but before we get into that please um if you want to see more videos from me on sql please consider subscribing to the channel below your screen right now you will see that red subscribe button please help me click on that red subscribe button Sub subscribe to the channel like the video and equally click on that notification bell and click on all so that whenever i upload any video on sql you come check it out so let me show you the method that doesn't work with oracle databases when trying to insert multiple rows so let's say insert into employees then we specify the columns in our own case we have employee employee number and the employee employee name so insert into employees into these columns then values then specify the values let's say 12 as the employee number 
then for the name let's say ken and ken then comma then the second uh, row another row we have um, something like uh, something like uh, maybe 25 comma Robbie Robbie or let's say Ali Ali then close and the final so we have multiple rows now to insert to our table insert into employees employee number employee name values so you can see the error message here if you run this let me clear this part first if you run this you can see the error message here sql command not properly ended because this doesn't work with oracle databases i think so there is a method that works with oracle databases and that is what i plan to you know show you in this video so let me get into that method that method is we have to use insert all first insert all then into employees the columns then value values because we have more than one value so we have values let's cut this one put it here with that comma let's delete this and then let's take copy this one again insert it so insert into employees employee number employee name values then let's use uh, the previous name robbie and here we have robbie so insert all into without insert insert all into employees employee number employee name and again you can see the error we are having an error here so what you have to do is to select star from dual that we remove the error so what is happening here Oracle needs a table with all select statements. Or let's say the insert all. This insert all statement requires a select statement. That is why we must include a select statement. Without the select statement, this will not work. So remember, the insert all statement requires a select statement that is why we have this select statement but why do we have from dua again oracle needs a table with all select statements you can see this select statement with all select statements oracle needs a table that is why we decided to use this dua table this is a dummy table Dua is a dummy table. We are not trying to, okay, Dua table is a dummy table in Oracle databases. Uh, it is used for selecting data from system functions and calculations when you don't need any data from the table. So we don't need any data from this Dua table, right? We are just trying to insert rows to our existing table 
employees table. So, in order to make this statement work, we have to include a table, and that's why we are using the dual table. That is how it works with Oracle. So, with this, let's run this and see if our code will function. So, let me clear this part. Then, let me run this. You can see two rows inserted. We have successfully inserted two rows to our employees table so let's go back and check let's populate let, i mean let's shake our table select star from employees then let's run let me clear this part let's run you can see we have the ken ken and robbie robbie way inserted so this is how to insert multiple rows on oracle databases that is it for this video for more videos on sql please consider subscribing to the channel click on that red subscribe button click on the notification bell and click on all so that whenever i upload a new video on sql you come check it out don't forget to like the video thank you and god bless